Russell Fork Pharmacy is your locally owned pharmacy, offering fast, friendly service with competitive prices and free delivery. Call 606-754-7085. Visit RussellForkPharmacy.com and download our free mobile app for refill requests and more. Students at the David School in Floyd County were joined by the Floyd County Sheriff's Office for the kickoff of their first ever Camp Falcon First Responders Camp. What kid doesn't want to be a firefighter or a police officer growing up? So we want to take them out, let them see the equipment, let them meet the people that, that's behind the equipment, what they do. And uh, it's just a wonderful opportunity to, to do for these kids in this area. An opportunity to build a bond between local first responders and the youth, allowing students to get a close-up look of what first responders go through each and every day. That's what you know. Our, a lot of our job is, is to get a bond at an early age and deterrence of crime and, and later on, but uh, we want the children to know who, who their protector is. And, uh, and, we, and we enforce, obviously, the parent role model at home and who to talk to and teachers and other people to talk to, but we want them to feel safe to approach a policeman out on the street, uh, come into our office and interact with us like, uh, like it's family. But, so we, we really want a close bond to us and children, and um, this is one way to do it. Principal Lafferty says that the week is a fun-filled outdoor adventure including a medical helicopter landing, a trip to the Martin Fire Department, and much more. Just a lot of fun stuff. Friday we'll end it up at the lake. We're going to go out on some pontoons and eat and, and just have a good time and uh, get familiar with our first responders here in the area. So we look forward to it. Today, students were able to try on vests that the Floyd County deputies wear, sit in the driver's seat of their vehicles, and learn about what it takes to be in law enforcement. And they got to uh, feel what it is to own some of the equipment that police wear and the, uh, what all it stands for and what it means and how it helps policemen do their job and how it helps policemen protect the public. Um, and now we have an artist here who, uh, who is famous in our area and who does so much for our office, uh, Peyton Martin, who's going to do sketches of each of the, of the campers, of the uh, students here. And uh, eventually we're going to let them do a, um, a mock crime where they witness somebody do a crime and we're going to let them give the description to Peyton and let him draw somebody that we know who it is and we'll see how close Peyton gets. To make sure that no kid was left out, Sheriff Hunt sponsored the event, making it free for all who attend. Uh, Brian reached out to us and we told him we'd be a full sponsor. We'll do everything. All they have to do is provide the facility and transportation, which we do too. And every day is going to be a different place. We're going to be here at David School. We'll be at the Corps of Engineers. We'll be at Martin Fire Department. Just helicopters are coming. The canine dogs will do a display. It's a really great time for the kids. They enjoy it, and uh, obviously we do too. It's just an honor and a privilege to be here with these kids and, and uh, local first responders. And uh, to see the kids on campus and, and smiling faces is uh, just wonderful. So, Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Jeremy Justice.